Hello and welcome back to Dark Souls 2. We here truly love this injury mad. I know the first is average of Spiffin and Glad to you. Fox is mad when cute is what this is the theme and the world I'm doing again. We're at Shattered Forge looking for a fight. Cruising for a cruising and uh, whichever other options there are for ensuring that we get some damage to ourselves before we kill everyone. Right. Oh, it's nice how the map actually connects up. Um, I guess there must be something this way that allows me to get up there. There is no obvious path, so it must be from upside. Top side, even. Look this way. There's water. And there's more water. Doesn't appear to be what would service me well in this situation. I think it may be correct to assume that I'm actually supposed to slide by the walls around there. What are you doing, Death? There you go. That's more like it. Ah, I see. No, death, no. No, death. What was that even? The father are you doing? Death. Do what you're supposed to do, which is jump, 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 jump some more. And then jump. Yeah, like this. Good job. Um Okay, I see. I almost forgot about that mechanic. Almost but not quite. Was there anything down there? There is something down there, but for that I require that over there. How would I get that over there? As long as it's over there, it's, it may be a challenge. And my axe. Impossible. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, I know. You're not much for carrying around this many potions. To be fair, neither am I. Can I just blow it up and call it a day? Done. And now what? I see. That's right. Is there anything on the? What this thing is? Not really a C. Okay. Pick it up and throw it. Shoot it. Pick up another and throw it. Can I just hold some? I can. Come on, give me another. He's gonna take him on a merry adventure. Right. I probably don't require this many, but you know. Don't take them with me. Oh, this one's stuck. This one's stuck, so I can only take this one, I guess. Maybe that does weren't as stuck as I assumed either. Uh, let's see. What is this? Omega Blades. The Omega Blades were built piece by piece from the shattered weapons of slain angels. When wielded, the Omega Blades ignite with raging fires. 
Each strike of the scythes can cause opponents to erupt into flames, and those flames can spread to the nearby enemies. This effect, known as the Omega Fire, consumes all those who oppose the balance. Okay. This doesn't actually appear to be as awesome as it could be. No, it's cool. It does a thing. It's a thing that may be thingy. Like, yeah, there's no sense bringing another bomb here, so let's get out of here. I'm fine. Then, but to be safe, I cannot. Pick it up. Bring it with us. We may require a bomb in our future. Well, you can't really open doors with bombs, apparently. Okay. Can I get that bomb? Perhaps not. But there is a bomb platform over there, so we can get to that. I didn't mean to do this! It's fine, did I explode this photo? I must have, yeah, because this is where we came from. Never mind. Okay. Um, not what I had in mind. Just let go. Uh, it's a good thing we have this now because this enables us to actually get somewhere. So kind, so kind indeed. No random jumping this time. Only purpose for jumping like that. Yeah. Where are you going now, Death? I hope I haven't accidentally caught him war again. Probably have at some point. Oh, you're volatile stuff? Ooh, you did notice. You, sir, are a kitty cat. You go meow, 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 and meow, meow, meow. Meow, you're a kitty cat. You're meow, 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 and meow, meow, meow. And I have an axe. Oh, and you have a death animation. Death, do all of your death animations of awesome or kind include the Reaper form because that's, that's probably gonna get you. I mentioned it. Unlock the door and let me go. I still have stuff to seek. Some people have loot seekers, others have stuff seekers. Never should the two collide. Open the door. Are we able to get on the floor? Maybe. Can we do the dinosaur? No, probably not. Because as I pointed out earlier, dinosaurs are extinct. Oh well. I don't know why that reference keeps popping up in my head. I should stop opening doors, maybe. Oh, that will happen. You look uh, like someone I killed already. So... Be thankful of that. Oh. <laughs> oh. I fucked that up. For some reason, my axe wasn't working. That's fine. Badass. Oh, hello. Painted construct warriors. Oh. 
it was some fun. Oh, another construct champion. <laughs> I keep running over a potion that keeps saying that it's impossible. There's no such thing as potions. They're not scientifically effective things. You cannot heal wounds just by drinking something. Maybe the Nephilim can. I cannot. No, you cannot. Impossible. It's impossible. Right, um what do we have here? We have a choice to do this. So let's do that. Upgrade another level. What is our choice? Critical damage or raffle crit? Let's do critical damage, yeah. And um, would you like some more upgrades? Because I have a lot of, of other useless items. Mm, those aren't. Apparently, the scythes are the most effective way to get a axe working. Right. Apparently, you can't just walk everywhere. Sometimes you have to war run. Good to know. I need a key. Anyone seen a key? I am in a dire need for one. We don't have any bombs either. The bombs are there though. How does one get up there? I'm not supposed to go in the water, am I? Doesn't matter, just did. No, it certainly looks like I'm supposed to get in the water. Can't see any interesting loot there. Descent path. Um, I've never descended at that angle while swimming myself. That seems terribly ineffective. On the other hand, the Nephilim don't need to hold their breath. Unlike me. I do. Alright. Oh. That's the bomb I'm seeking. Oh. Does it? Where am I? How did I get here? Another one of these. I hope we don't need more of them than these two. Up we go. Well, there's still some decor about, but uh, I can hope that it's simply decor. Does it look like it's actually guarding anything valuable? Alright, so this takes me where? Here, but I can't actually get here yet. Guess that's gonna have to be fine. Hello? Anyone here? I wonder if there's any water loot now. Because there's such an obvious uh, return here once you've fallen up off there. I'm gonna check for water loot. Hi water, do you have loot? Nope, doesn't feel like it. I guess it's just for getting back up then. That makes sense too. Though I would have preferred loot. This loot is very sad. It's all about 
What did they say once looting for the settings? Yeah, that's that's the one. What are you? Ooh, book of the dead page. That's nice. Yeah, this is not going to be the most effective way, I think. I think with these particular folks, it's more effective to just widely spin around my weapon. I think the shield is down. I think it has a shield on occasion anyway. But I'm not entirely sure. I don't know what it is. Other than be it, oh. Get me away from there. I may have to heal at some point. That's very soon. I'm just gonna use the lifesteal weapons because then I won't have to heal as much, maybe. How do I kill you use? Be it Ooh. Wrong target. Ooh. So once I've removed the target from the existence, I can shoot that. Reload. You got the carbon stone. I thought I could only get those from the lost temple. Apparently not. Cool. I'm okay with that. That means I can return to the shaman. Do the uh, some shaman. Okay, um I can upgrade everything into you again, right? Yeah. Ooh. That's cool. I did realize I had used the scythe set. My axe is almost complete. <laughs> I probably won't do what exactly I wanted to do anyway because I do not have the abilities for that. What are you? Ah, the skeleton key. Yeah, cool, I didn't remember where the lock is. Now I remember, it was right down there. That's fine. Could have gone down the ledge and they uh, used that to ride over. Oh, that doesn't touch you, but too much. <laughs> Silly Andrew's face. Open the door. Oh, we're almost done here. That's nice, actually. Yeah. Give me your hammer. How did the hammer get in the center pedestal? In the hands of skilled blacksmith, this hammer grants the ability to forge powerful weapons and armor. Return this weapon to Valus. How deep does this go? Just deep enough to get me a Pokemon coin. Cool. Let's take it. Here. Alright, um. Do we actually have to leave the dungeon or can I just quick travel now? I'll just try quick traveling now. Alright. So back to dry stone. Oh, wait. Yeah, I can fast travel right now. Ah. Okay. I have two people I need to talk to. Valus with. <laughs> And, uh, do I have to speak to Valus or, I don't know. Anyway, hey, you promised me something. A heart in the forest, a mind that is dreaming. Awaken him, horseman, or you will never escape. 
The one I seek. The warden I seek. Who was he? He was a great builder once. He has been dreaming for ages. Some say that his dreams help build our realm, give it form and color. If so, shaman, then his dreams have long since turned to nightmares. I fought the materials. Here is what you asked for. Ah, thank you, horseman. You'll not be sorry for your trouble. This talisman will certainly help you on your quest. But I fear you will not break your destiny. No, but I believe I might bend it a little. What was old is new again. Maker known only as the Mad Smith forged this talisman using the arms and armor of slain warriors from the Dead Plains. Grim, as the talisman was called, was crafted to distill and concentrate necromatic power from the beast. The Grim talisman makes any weapon wielded by its owner build reaper energy with every successful attack. Are you the Mad Smith? Something. Yes, that troubles me. I didn't think you were a Smith. Uh, what's this? Undying increases the health of ghouls. I didn't actually use the ghouls, and apparently they're not as useful as I was hoping for. Uh, what's this? Uh, Death surrounds himself with a necromatic shield, uh, significantly increasing his defense and resistance. Um, Mode of crowds emerges from the Edda, called by Death to attack his foes. Mm. Ripping increases the chance of scoring a critical hit. Uh, on enemies stuck by harvest. Oh, that sounds pretty good. Enemy struck by harvest increased the damage dealt by all of death's attacks for a short time. Oh, that, that was actually really useful. Death's unearthly strength in, in, is increased for a short time. Breath generation incre is increased. What's that? Hitting enemies with terrible slash also causes an explosion. Oh, but I need to unlock this path then. Thank you. It's not like I actually use any of that, you know. If I have to keep my options open, I'm gonna keep the fancy one open. Yeah. Fancy. Balance, I bring you... Bone Splitter. Was it? I think it does. Let's I bring you a hammer. Yo. Hmm. Okay, I guess I need to speak to you instead. Oh, skill point awarded. That was before. Hi. Here is your hammer. I believe you were looking for something. Ah, oh, Splinterbone. You found it. I, sh I don't know what to say. Mm -hmm. I leave you to your work, Ballas. Mm -hmm. Should you come this way again, you may find items of even greater power. Well, let's take a look. Browse around. We have new items. Ooh, this... Wait, no, no. Apparently these things do more damage now, but they're not really all well, that... You'll have to offer more than that. This may be pretty interesting though. But I'm gonna need more money for that. They don't have more money for that. No purples here yet. No purples here. No purples here. No more wraps. That's resistance. Experience and extra gold. No longer are the boots of the nomad available. Do I have anything I can sell you? No, not really. I just wanna sell the legendary items. Okay, uh, anyway, that concludes today's episode, so thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. There we go, that should give me. Preserved in times of peace once more. Like my vacation. <laughs>